What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of crash on startup or crashing on startup issue you're currently having with the Hunt Showdown. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want to you guys know, or let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys, you will support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So the first step I would recommend for doing for everybody is gonna be to navigate to the very bottom of your screen where you're gonna right click your taskbar and simply open it up. Your task manager I mean. Next step is going to be to navigate to the top left corner of your screen where you're going to click into processes. And once you click processes, I want you to click one of those random processes, doesn't really matter which one. And simply search for your D-Hunt showdown. If nothing pops up, it's good for you. If something pops up, simply right click and end the task. Once you're finished, navigate to the top right corner and end this task again. Next step is going to be to take your Steam or your D-Hunt showdown shortcut on your desktop. And if you don't have it on your desktop, simply navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen where you're going to click into the Windows symbol and use the Windows search function in order to find it. So once you found it, simply drag it right back on your desktop, take it, right click it and hit run as an administrator. This will make your game or your launcher pop up. If it crashes again, simply take your shortcut again, right click and go to the very bottom where it says properties. Once this one pops up, hit compatibility and simply copy my settings. So let's quickly run through it. Enable run this program in compatibility mode 4, select Windows 8, disable the full screen optimizations, disable that and enable run this program as an administrator, hit apply and OK. I would personally recommend to restart your PC afterwards and once it is restored, you should be able to see this little administrator symbol right on your shortcuts. So I want you to simply double click it and launch a game and launch a game over the launcher. This will probably fix your issue. Yeah, guys, that's it for the video. And I would, I hope that I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. And yeah, guys, I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.